Hey everybody, my name is Jake Brown from General RV and welcome to our virtual showroom. Let's take a look at some of the features of this gorgeous RV. Thanks Jake. Hey everyone, I'm Matt. I'm Andrea. And today I'm super excited. We're taking a look at the 2021 Thor Ace Model 27.2. This is a small motorhome, Matt. Actually, Andrea, it is one of the smallest Class A gas motorhomes in the entire world. I'm super excited to show everybody. Let's go take a look. Perfect. Oh my gosh, this does not look like the Thor Ace that I remember. Andrea, you're right. In 2021, they did a completely new redesign and just take a look at these white oh my cabinets. Oh goodness, I love it. Yes, not only is the cabinetry new, the front cockpit area oh, is. Oh, I can't wait to see this. Let's get started. Okay, this is new too, wow. Notice the lower doghouse, okay? So 2021, they switched to the new Ford 7.3 liter v8 engine and what that did was a couple things it gave you more horsepower more torque and a smaller doghouse so as you saw andrea it's easier for you to yes. walk up and down check this out i love that that nice computer tray and right over there folks we have a doggy window so when you're driving down the road and your dog's laying there she can she or he can see out the window or your cats everyone yep or it can be a kitty window <laughs> Right up here, you have your new design of the 7.3 liter engine. Um, this is the steering wheel though. It's the new design, that's how you can tell. And you have this nice big 10 inch screen. It is the radio. Also, you can see your left blinker, right blinker and reverse. Awesome. And then Andrea, notice this right here. Oh yeah, they have a nice bunk over the cab. They sure do. Let me find that button. Okay, oh, look at that. Yep. Now it does only hold 250 pounds, so I'm gonna say it's good for one person, but I really like this bunk mechanism style. Yes. So check that out. Oh my gosh, look at all the storage around it. Yeah, not only that, here's the feature that I love about this bunk. God forbid if the bunk over the cab does not want to go back up, you can still get in here and drive back. I do not recommend that at all, but it's one of those things where some bunks over the cab, it will completely drop your visibility. So it is a nice feature, you okay. know, just in case. I can see that. But always call an RV mechanic first. Check out this, this is nice. Yes. Look at the cabinetry, wow. Uh -huh. Great space. Nice big windows with your shades right there. Notice how there's also cup holders right there. Okay, I like that we have this sofa here. Very comfortable, like the cup holders. Very nice. And this also jacks nice into a bed so you can sleep. Show us, show us. on that. Very easy. Yes, very Even easy. Andrea can do it. There you go. Very nice. Okay, and we got the dinette over here. Yes. I like this. I like that it's directly across the TV from the sofa. I like the windows. Perfect, there's cup holders in here, Matt, look. Absolutely. And we, we have not storage. one, but two storage underneath. Fantastic. And it does drop down to make a bed. Also, Andrea, look at this. This is a car seat tether. So if you have a car seat, you can safely transport everybody. That's awesome. Okay, let's check out this kitchen. Wow, I gotta say, I really am loving the new look here. I like this, they gave you adjustable shelves. So we got sponges, we got three drawers there. I like, that. oh look, they already gave you the trash can. Not Excellent. one, but two trash cans, <laughs> I love that. Nice big sink. Big farmhouse style sink. We got a microwave. Uh-huh. I love that we, you're, you're, they gave you an oven here. Yep. It's great. And let's see, we got the refrigerator two-way, runs off your propane and your shore power. And then right here oh, we have a pantry. Oh, that's, look at this, I love this. Yes. Now, even though this is such a small Class A, Andrea, you still have a door for privacy, so you do have a bedroom and a living area. It's a actually a, a really good entryway here. Yep, it makes such a small motorhome yes. feel so big and spacious. Absolutely. 
Also, what's very impressive. King size bed. Exactly. Even though this motorhome's under 30 feet and it's one of the smallest class A's out there, they're still able to function it to give you the king size bed. They gave you storage above the bed. That's great. Okay, look at this, Matt. They did give you a privacy curtain, so that way you can have that closed if your guests need to access the bathroom. Yeah, the privacy curtain sits on this track so they can still make it to the bathroom. Oh, look at that wardrobe. Man, that's there a lot of There is the pedestal table that goes in between the two front passenger seats up there. Does swivel. And nice big drawer. drawer. Let's check out this bathroom. All right. Oh my gosh. First. Oh, I like this shower. Great size. I nice. like this. Great height in here, everybody. You do have a sink right there. Yes. Do you have a sink and a cabinet underneath? Very nice. Okay, Matt, let's see that toilet. All right. Let's see how it fits. This is a nice porcelain toilet. It's in a good position. Again, small motorhome, small bathroom, but we can 100% make it work, especially because we're trying to stay in a size yes. that's easy to drive, easy to camp at state and national parks. Absolutely. So, I like that. Me too. Well, Andrea, okay. the new interior looks great, but it looks even better on the outside. Let's go take a look. Perfect. Okay, Matt. Check it out. Small motorhome, but you have a huge awning. The length of the whole yes. RV. Not only was the interior new, Andrea, there's some exterior features that are new that I want to tell you about. Not only that, the warranty. New for 2021, Thor now has the longest warranty in the industry. A six year lamination warranty and 12 year structural. That's unheard of and trust me folks, it is going to change the RV industry. That's wonderful. Let's start up here. So the Ace is Thor's number one selling motorhome and it's been out for years. And what Ace originally stood for was Class A, Class C evolution. So the whole concept behind this motorhome is that it's a Class A motorhome with a Class C floor plan. That's what's making it so short and compact and I like that. Also new for 2021, they added this partial body paint option. Also, if you notice how the windshield's not the biggest, it does have that brow. That's gonna help sunlight from going in your eyes when you're driving west during the sunset or east <laughs> in the sunrise. It looks good. Yep. Check out those tires. These are the Goodyear tires. Uh -huh. <laughs> Here's your window right there. And then check out these chrome mirrors right here. They do have the camera integrated in the left blinker, right blinker, and reverse. We got a TV. Uh-huh. Nice. Let's see what's in here. Storage? Oh no, batteries. Okay. Yep, that's your batteries in your hydraulic leveling. Okay, batteries. Oh, look at this storage. That's great. Very nice storage, especially for a small motor. Oh, absolutely. We got more storage here. Okay. You can never have enough. Yep. Now the Ace is the number one selling motorhome in the country because of its price point. Okay, it's a great starter motorhome. But I like how they didn't take some shortcuts that some other manufacturers are doing. Like I love the frameless windows. That's a very high end feature and yes. I'm glad they put it on this product. Absolutely. So you can leave your windows open in the rain if you forget to close them and you won't get a leak. They also gave you a propane quick connect. Absolutely. So you can bring your propane grills. Yep. Here's power on the exterior in case you want to hook up a golf cart. And then here's where you fill up your portable water or your potable water. And that is for cases when you're boondocking and you need to bring the water with you. Got more storage and more storage. Wow. Absolutely. And that's part of the Class A, Class C evolution. Class C's don't have a ton of exterior storage. So this is that Class A exterior storage with the Class C interior living. It's, it's awesome. Around the back, you have an 8,000 pound hitch. Wow. That is huge for a Class A gas motorhome. I always like to tell people before you tow the max, you always want to weigh your motor home and check the GVWR and the GCWR just to be safe. Absolutely. And look, they gave you, a, you got the backup camera there as well. Integrated in the rear tail light and your fuel fill up is in the rear. And I love that because when you go to gas stations, you can fill it up on either the left side or right side. It doesn't matter where your fuel pump is. You can still fill this 
thing up with fuel. And Matt, what kind of roof do you think is on this? Uh, this has a one-piece TPL roof with a 12-year warranty awesome. on it. Awesome. Okay, I see this. Here's the generator. It's Now, this is a 30-amp motorhome, so there's only one AC unit on it, part of it being like a Class C, and they give you the Cummins Onan 4000 generator. All right. More storage. Look at this. It's absolutely crazy. That is kind of crazy, isn't it? Yep. And then I believe there's even more storage underneath. Underneath here? Yep. Well, oh, no. We got our uh, black tank okay. hookup. It's where you dump your black and gray tank, and I love how it's enclosed, so it's going to help protect it from the elements. Absolutely. And look at that. Okay, so here's your outdoor shower, and it has a second gray tank dump, probably for the sink. Got the city water connection here. Look, Matt, they did a great job continuing the paint over the water heater. Well, not paint, stickers and decals, but what Andre is saying is a lot of times manufacturers, they'll just leave this cream or tan or white. Or black. Right, and it doesn't look good. It takes, Thor spends a little additional time to continue the pattern of the decal so it blends in well. And then this is where you hook up your city water for when you're camping. Yes, and more storage. There's the storage. I'm telling you, the storage is incredible on this. And then this one, to wrap it all up, is your propane tank right there. And that is a huge propane tank for such a small motorhome. Hey everybody, thanks for watching. Make sure you go to generalrv.com forward slash virtual showroom to check out thousands of our RVs, motorhomes, travel trailers, and fifth wheels. We'll see you on the lot.